Hey guys, I got this really cool book to show you today. It is called Free Spirit and it is from Jess Mahari. Mahari, Mahari, I'm not sure. Um, this says it's a book, a coloring book for calming your mind, freeing your imagination, and igniting your soul. I was drawn to the cover with these um, beautiful horses on here. Um, it's really nice. It's got that plasticky sounding cover. Um, that's what the binding looks like. It's a real heavy book. Good quality. Nice pages. I like how they did the cover. It looks like it is not perforated. I love these little fat horses. <laughs> I just, I love the whimsy hand doodle look that she's got. She's got an um, introduction here. Um, got an introduction page here. And then she goes on to talk about, you'll find some of these friends in the following pages of Free Spirit. Um, so you can look for them. It's just really cute how she how she draws. I just really like it. <clears throat> These owls are neat. The horses. Just got name words and names written on them. Love, freedom, courage. Let's see if I can get a little closer in. Hold on. I have a hard time. This one, it's like an outdoor scene. We got a wolf and bear here. Look, all the hair is made out of animals. Like there's a giraffe here, a fish, a bull, seahorse. So there's a butterfly here. That's neat. And then she has all these really pretty sayings on these pages like make sure the ones you love know how you feel about them time is precious and sacred let it be now create memories that sparkle with love I love this and then it's got like I'm gonna say this is mother nature and she's holding her little baby it's beautiful there's that wise old owl up here and she's just got little hidden words and quotes all intertwined into her pictures very very whimsical this is the kind of book you're either gonna love it or are you just gonna like hate it i personally love it i could definitely see myself watercoloring even though it's um the paper is a better quality than copy paper, um, but it's single sided and it's perforated. So you could tear it out and watercolor it, markers, whatever you want to do. Sorry, you hear people in the background. My family's home today and it's loud. Um, this is beautiful right here. She's got her little baby. through this book it's just like inspiring I don't, I don't know why I don't know how to explain it all the different aspects it's just very very neat be kind to animals and I just I love her little fat animals <laughs> oh my god really really love how she makes her little animals like little chunky this is so cute to me I absolutely adore this page I'm gonna get in here with my um, my markers and color this one. It's adorable. And then there's parts of places that you can write things in here. Um, what are the ingredients of a rich life? I love this. And then right here, you can write it right on the little river line, colored by. 
thing. This one is like a tree. We got a fairy here. Cute, cute. I like the moon. We got this wolf and owl flying over. And all kinds of cool stuff. I like the, oh, we got some mermaids here. This is a really pretty page. Oh, I just realized the mermaid is sitting on what looks like a whale. And there's a peace symbol. Very cool. We are Stardust. I mean, this is some really cool stuff in this book. Faith, courage, enthusiasm forever. What floats your boat? You can write some stuff down here. This is one of the only pages that I really didn't care for, but that's just me. I just don't like... I don't know. You can't love them all, can you? But for the most part, I really, really like the book. I like the randomness of all the different elements put together, I guess. And it's almost like a journal, too, because there's different prompts and things you can write in. Eclectic, I guess. Got a little thing here you can fill in. All kinds of stuff to read and look at. List, uh, list 10 things from your life you are grateful for right here. This is a really nice book. I really like it. This, I'm going to color this one first, y'all. I am so, so doing this one and hanging it up in my room. I love it. I love the saying on it. I'm going to write some stuff in here. Um... Well, the background, just, uh, just everything about this, I just absolutely think it's awesome. Just a really cool book. Something for everybody in here. <laughs> this elephant one. <laughs> I wish you'd just make a whole entire book of fat animals, like big fat unicorns, and <laughs> it would be so cute. Oh. This is neat. This almost looks like, um, this almost looks like it's carved by a stamp, and she stamped it to me. It's probably not it, but it, that's what it looks like. It looks like a stamp. I love it. I love these um, peacock feathers too. There's just a lot going on in here. It's almost like an art journal to me. There's a lot of vibrant colors and and things in here. List three things, uh, list three of your joys and make sure you do at least one of them today. And then she's got acknowledgments. And we have a really good read about the author herself. And there's another fat horse. <laughs> and then what I like, I like this page, okay? On, on all these, she's got a little clippings of each page, and it says colored by, date, mood, mood, and gave to. So you can keep track of them. <coughs> I really think that's neat. I really think that's really neat. Every page has got one of those. Okay, so it's a really neat book. Um, I'll post a link to where you can find this and purchase it. And if you have any questions or comments, leave it down at the bottom and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Um, thanks a lot for watching. And if you have not subscribed, please do down here for me. It helps me out. Um, and hit that thumbs up. It, it, it helps my channel out a lot. Thank you so much for watching. See you later. Bye.